sharing me what for the in these past years, hell, ever since we got married, in fact, for some reason, I have this unnerving feeling that you are still up to your own rights. What? You remember what happened last time? You tried to pull one over on me? Yes. And you remember your punishment. Don't you? Yes. So please, if you would, help me understand. Why are you trying again, knowing you're going to lose again? Try what? Idiot. I have many things, but not an idiot. As soon as you showed up with that boy, I knew what you had planned. But I decided to indulge him. Didn't think much of it because <laughs> what could a man do to me? Then I started to realize your plan. I know what you're trying to do. I still have all the pieces on how you're going to do it. At first, of course, I had to overlook the whole him suddenly coming across the river sticks taking a swim in the waters. He just so happened to drink some by accident. When he shouldn't have even been there to begin with. Well, accidents do happen. Yeah, I guess so. The training with Hephaestus well, he wants to be strong. Like us. <laughs> yes, there it is. Yeah, there, that's what I was waiting for you to say. Well, like us. Or stronger than us. Or should I be more direct? Why I say stronger than me? <laughs> uh. I don't know what you're trying to imply. You are too smart to not know exactly what happened. Seriously, I'm laying it out for you already. I know what you're trying to do. It's not going to work. That boy. <sighs> That boy is never going to be able to, to surpass me. Impossible. There's no way a mortal can even hope to beat me, but I do. I'm not going to lie. I appreciate the attempt. I admire that fiery side of you, but you know it's not going to work. But then I started thinking how weird it was that you wanted to be more of a mother figure. 
and then I uh, got wind of something. Something very crucial that, that I think you might have some idea about. Um, and that would be the Griffin. <laughs> what? Wait, what? You know that boy is trying to obtain the Griffin. Don't, don't get me wrong, horses are plenty of finesses on their own, right? But Griffin, of all things, their speed is extraordinary. Something that I must say is very suspicious to why, uh, why would he want one? Maybe he just wasn't a pet. If he wanted a pet, Hephaestus could have made him one, if he so asked. All your lessons about teaching him how to be faithful to his potential spouse, respect people's boundaries, especially this thing you call consent. <laughs> it's all useless. The pawn isn't going to be able to take me down. Why would you be accusing me of such ludicrous scheming? Because, my dear, I know you. <laughs> oh, yes, I know you very well. Inside and out. So, just so you know, I know what you're trying to do. It's not going to work, but you get an A for effort. I suppose. But your biggest mistake is thinking that I wouldn't notice. As absent as I am. It has not keep me from hearing things. On the contrary. I have eyes and ears everywhere. Everywhere is my domain. I have you know, ways to gather information. I say I am very curious. And really want to see how this whole play of yours turns out. You can keep up the schemes if you want, but as long as you know that it's useless against me. Understood. I'm so glad we had that talk. You can leave now. <laughs> of course. What are they planning? I, I, I don't know. Ugh. That is not what I want to hear. Hmm. Wait a moment. Uh, Festus. Why don't we bring him to the fray? 
See if he knows anything. I've already looked into it. He knows nothing. Hmm. You gotta go through the boys' room. N no. He's had, he has it worn up and with enchantments. And it's impossible for me to get through them. Hmm. Interesting. Why would we need such a high level of security for Sorry? <laughs> oh. oh. I just thought of something that could take care of this little pain in my neck. What would you suggest? Of course, Hera isn't going to spill anything when it comes to her plans against me. That boy, considering, though, well, yes, he is trying to become like us. Mm. He's most likely going to be loyal to that woman. I want him to be docile, submissive, <laughs> just like his mother. You're talking about Queen Hera, right? Yes. First, I need him broken. I need him scared, traumatized. I need to put him in such a sorry state that he won't even want to leave his room ever again. But if I have just the perfect plan to do such a interesting task. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going to be fun to witness. No. <laughs> Oh, um, I just slept a little too. Hmm. Well, I might as well get started on my griffin hunt. I'm pretty sure I have everything I need. Well, you don't need these. Uh, what are these, uh, brothers? Seriously. Mechanical horses. Wait, what? Yeah. They're griffins. Yeah. Wait. Wait. That might actually work my favor. Uh, yeah. Here, explain. Wait, you you gave me these chemical horses, and they even consider what I might use them for. Well, it's obvious you were using for transport. As much as that would help me. There's more to it than that. As you know, Griffins hate horses. With a passion. Yes, I knew that. So, yeah, when they see a horse, it's on sight. 
the, the, there is no mercy. True. Mechanical horses, especially ones made by you, they look pretty damn realistic. Why, thank you. Whatever. <clears throat> Either way, I can use a spade as soon as I do end up finding said griffins. Hmm. But. Fine thing, I'm going to be very quick about it. Like, so finding them, considering, you know, uh, that's like I do. Huh. Remember that finding enchantment you taught me? Yes. What about it? Oh, yeah. Ugh. At the very least, if I can tame a adult griffin or an adolescent, I, I can at least try to nab an egg and, you know. Hmm. Yeah. Go ahead, bond yourself to it before it's inherently bonded to Zeus. Huh. Very smart. <laughs> Believe me, it was not easy. I had to do a lot of research on griffins before I could really prepare prepare for it. I mean, well, thanks for certain those those buggers really don't want anyone taking their treasure cord. No, no, they don't. Ugh. I mean, if one piece of it goes missing, they could go on a complete rampage. Though gods can handle it, mortals, not so much. Huh. What, law of your mind? It's just... I don't want to just kidnap the poor thing. The, the Griffin? Yeah. I mean, how would you feel if you were swiped away from your family? You're asking the wrong person, the very wrong question. The, oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. But I do get your understanding. So, here's something you can do. Just to make yourself feel less guilty. I'm listening. Just in case. Just, I mean this. There is a rare chance that two A's could be first. What? Wait, 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 I thought it was only, yeah. But sometimes things this could be very promising. I mean, yes, if you take their egg, and it's the only one, they're most likely gonna hunt you down until your dying breath. But being that it does have more eagle brain, you say bird brain, maybe. It may see that egg is weak. It's weaker than the one that you could leave behind. But I'm not sure that's going to work. What? Yeah, I mean, thank you for the advice and everything, but I don't think that's going to work. Why not? Well, I might both mortals. I would just give away their kids or sell them off their kids just to make up a little bit more extra coin. 
Yeah, Gryffindors are not like that. Oh. So even if I do have this very rare opportunity, the odds of it really succeeding the way you think are slim. Possibly hopeful, but slim. Make a good point, little brother. Well, lots to think about. It's one thing for, you know, just to build something I expected to work flawlessly, but. Hmm. Yeah. This is a messy business. If I could just get this over with. Uh, uh, what? What do you mean, get this over with? What are you trying to do? It's like, hmm. nothing. I'm just sick. You gotta think. Hmm. Just about the losers. Eggs getting destroyed are pretty darn high. So, yes, it's a griffin egg. It does not mean it's indestructible. Ugh, probably should have got a phoenix instead. But no. I gotta go for a griffin. And I feel like it's gonna hurt me a lot. I gathered you here to discuss an issue we are having. What is it this time, Zeus? So glad you asked, Hephaestus. It's about Yuzuku. What? Yeah. You see, it seems it's almost like somebody again him ready to go uh I don't know a scorched earth on somebody. You think someone's trading Izuku not just trading, ripping him to the point where he can be a pain in a certain someone's ass. To be more specifically my ass. He, so I like to brainstorm on how we can fix that. You want us to help you find a way to keep Izuku from being your ass? Yeah, exactly. I mean, if I think I should know something was wrong as soon as it showed up, I let my guard down because it was apparently a mortal. And then, I, uh, you know, Hera decided to raise it. Make us worse, she actually breastfed him. And you know how that happened with Hercules. Um, you might not need to talk about what happened with Hercules in front of Hera right now. But yeah, she got over it, right? Hera still being a little... Of course I did. It's for, of course I bear no ill will to your bastard who I was tricked into feeding and bit me. But see, see, she she's over it. She doesn't care. But <clears throat> that doesn't matter. Hand, I think we need to tell Yuzuku to. Oh, how should I put this? Step off. Stay in his lane. It's just training. It's not hurting anyone. 
<sighs> of course, you will see it's just training you all, or but this it would be training for him to do some push ups or something and run a marathon, or even train where you by finding those robots you make him. This is how we brought this up with Hera. The River Sticks, isn't it? Hades. Hey, I had no idea about that. He was drinking the water. He was swimming in it. He likes to taste the, the bar from the River Sticks. Uh-huh. <laughs> And, uh, the enchantments? What? Oh, don't play dumb, Professor. You've been in this room. You checked out all of the magic he used to safeguard his own room. And what a coincidence! I can't enter his room! Well, you, uh, I think I can explain that. You can't enter his room? No! Oh, oh wow. What? What? <laughs> <sighs> what is it? Those enchantments, all that magic, warding his room, hell, even the door, is it to keep you out? Excuse me? Yeah, what is that? Is it for you? It's for Aphrodite. What? How could you know? Oh, that's right, you weren't here that day. Where are you? Explain. You see. <clears throat> One time, we were just having a nice little get-together with Dionysus. Mm -hmm. One of my favorite <laughs> children. Of course. I really got into some particularly potent wine. Um, are you saying she got drunk? Ew, ew, sense. You say it made her more fairy. Wait, what? Primal, you could say. Huh. Keep going. You still don't get it? No. She was more thirsty than a bitch in heat. Oh. Yeah. Wait, what's that got to do with the... Oh. Mm-hmm. So... Huh. So what you're saying is she tried to jump and... Tried, almost did. What? Yeah, it took a lot to for her to get her on him. Huh. Interesting. And that's why he has his room souped up with all that? Yep. Mess with him pretty bad. So he's scared of Aphrodite. Oh, without a doubt. Yeah, he is scared. <laughs> okay. Hmm. So, let me see. Hephaestus, do me a favor. What? Get rid of all those enchantments and wards out of this room. No. Why not? 
Cuz, Cuz, hey, I know you. You're, you were a complete asshole. Yeah, but you should have told me as much as you did. Everyone's just looking around, see, looking at the disappointed faces of Hades and Hera. Oh, so you're planning on? Oh, yes. Shame, but if I want that boy to behave himself, I'm going to need him to never want to leave his room again. You evil bastard. Hey, it's not my fault. He, he can't seem to remember his placement in the Grand Order. You're planning on traumatizing a little boy just because you're scared? I... I am not scared. I am pissed. There is a difference. Well, sounds like you're threatened over a little boy. Hera, I do not want to hear anything out of that mouth of yours. <laughs> if anything, I am not scared of a little mortal. <laughs> yeah, you say that, but your actions, uh, they say something completely different. Oh? Please, let me, what do you think? You're scared of this little boy about to overthrow you. How will he ever be able to overthrow me? Though, yes, I might not be able to kill him. Sure. Yeah. That's right. River Sticks? I can't really kill him. Can I? What is that? So they're wrong? It's sharp. Ah, you know, like, I'm not scared of some little rat. It's just. I, uh. have a lot. On my plate, and I do not need any distractions. Though, for a boy who wants to play God, nah. We told you what I want you to do, but you seem to not want to listen. Do you not like walking? What? I will make sure to personally break your legs, break your arms, until you won't even be able to look at a hammer the same. Do not threaten me does not make you want to help you any more. Uh, what? Did you say I threatened you? Uh, yeah, that's just exactly what you did. So, no, 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 no. No. If that were fly, I wouldn't do it. I'm giving you a promise that I am definitely going to do it if you do not do what I say. Is that so? <laughs> Well, I guess I'm going to, to put a lot of things on back order. What? Yeah, if you want to try that crap with me? Yeah. Uh, I'm not still not doing what you say. You're serious? Yeah. I might be dumb enough to accidentally spill the beans on one of his childhood traumas, but I am not dumb enough to help you 
rumor him. Huh. Well, that's too bad. Heck, I was going to learn a lot of years to get back with Aphrodite. That's like, maybe. She is not. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare try to defend. Don't you. Oh, oh, I hear that from you. Sweet. I think everyone knows she's been ran through so many times. Uh, she, oh, seriously. Clearly, I'm surprised you haven't tried clapping it yet. Hi. As yes, so this is looking back, seeing the chuckling faces that is Hera and you no, know, as well as Hades. So, yeah, this person's got a point. Actually, what? If anyone would have clapped that, I was a bit surprised you did. Hero could seem to really control her laughter, let alone wanting to. Just wanting to express, like, yeah. So this is, uh, this is what your kingdom is now. So, yeah. As you can imagine, Zeus is getting more and more pissed. Threatening pretty much everyone. Which is pretty much as it was as Hades and Hera. They're not budging. Because, uh, as far as being able to kill them, I don't really think there is no real concrete way. Hey, even when it comes to the whole thing with huh, Uranus, you know, Zeus's grandpa. It didn't say he really died. It just said he got his, uh, his twig and berries removed. <laughs> so as far as thinking with death, Sorry, not going to work on them. Nice try, though, but no, no. So, Zeus is a loss. He sure told him, um, the message is like, no, we're not going to do what you say. Maybe the king of us would. If anything, we heal fast enough. He invests this. But his, uh, little limp and such sure isn't that as bad as it was before. <laughs> uh, I can't believe this. You're actually, you're actually studying up to me. Oh my. This is, this is insane. How in the hell? It, when did you look as much as you may have a huge power advantage over us don't forget we almost overthrew you I uh, not to mention, if we hadn't gotten that little, you know who, <laughs> yeah, you definitely would be on that throne right now. <laughs> I must say, I'm, uh, I'm at a loss. I didn't expect any of you to actually have the stones to actually see all this. Especially you. Hades. I, I, I am shocked. Oh, yeah. 
I don't think there's any Kahala that really likes you. If anything, as long as you don't mess with them, they don't care. <laughs> and besides, you may as so well, we can't interfere with each other's lives or activities. <laughs> Okay, yeah. Yeah, I did, didn't I? Interesting. Like you said, brother, you pretty much, you did give us freedom to do whatever we want. As long as we don't mess with each other directly. <laughs> I'm sorry, what was that? Threaten me? You just threaten me? Whatever do you mean? <laughs> I'm sorry, you must be hard hearing. Did you really just threaten me? Uh, I don't even remember what you're uh, no, 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 you, you deliberately said that, uh, I gave you freedom to do whatever you want as long as we, I don't directly, or anyone directly misses with us. That's kind of suspicious, don't you think, brother? Uh, believe what you want. It makes you no different. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, good, good, good advice. Very good advice. Huh. I guess I really did give you a, a fair amount of freedom. And you have every right. To use that freedom however you wish. Oh, whether it be building objects that could potentially harm us or me. Oh, probably making sure no more my children grow up with parents, let alone me having any more, let alone her permission, or someone who's been caught blocking me every so often until, what, spring? What are you saying? Oh, nothing, it's just... If she knows how happy Persephone is when she comes back to you. You, son. I'm just saying. If you were uh, that good of a spouse, you probably uh, wouldn't want to leave in the first place. Did you just... I didn't... I didn't say anything. I just... I'm just concerned about your wife's well-being. Your daughter. I know. I... I know. But... If not you... Can you really help me? I guess I have no choice but to really accept it. I'm sure I can find other ways to get what I want. You're all dismissed. Uh, yeah, you can say there. You can hear a feather drop. We'll say that after a whole 
conference. Hayes is pissed. Hera and Hephaestus are looking at him like, are you all right? Oh, you yeah, have I'm good, I'm good. Of course, it's fine. <laughs> so, how are we getting rid of Zeus? What? Oh, whatever plan you got, Hera, I know you have one. I'm in. Seriously? Oh, yeah. I want that bastard dead. Probably even more than you now. Really? Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. I don't care. What you need? Tell me. Just let me know what do you need. I, I'll i do I'll do it. Need some more water from the river sticks? We're in the drink? I got you. Need him to take another dip in it? Yes. Well, we need to give him one of Cerberus's puppies. And I got you. I want this fun. on. Well, I can honestly say I did not expect on having your support. Wait, what? Hmm? Yes, Hephaestus. So you actually were planning on having Izuku overthrow? Um, yeah. So it's not just because you saw him as a uh, No, of course not. Really? I just want to get rid of my husband. That, that's all this is. Hmm. You say that, but... I've seen how you've been treating him. Yeah, so what? It's obvious that you, I can't believe I've seen this, care about this moral. Don't be ridiculous. All matters is getting rid of Zeus. <sighs> Okay. Either way, I already told him about the Orfeo Taurus. What? Uh, I'm sorry. You did what? Calm down, Hades. Yes, I told him about the Orfeo Taurus. Saying they would give him some divine power or what? Ever. It's the power to overthrow the gods. Us. Not just Zeus, us. True. But at the very least, it's a wait a minute. Hmm? What? Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. When no. he said, when he thanked me that day, it, it was you. Huh? He thanked me for some advice. At first, it was because I ended up, uh, you know, telling him to make sure whoever he ends up being with stays away from Zeus. But no, what really is up? Uh, what's up? He thought I told him about the Orpheo Taurus, but it was you impersonating me. How did you not get... How, how did you not figure that out? Oh, we were in your domain. What? Yep. Hera! <laughs> what? You don't know how screwed we'd be if Zeus... Like, if Zeus finds out... He knows about the beast. 
if he finds out. Hmm. If. It was good. Yeah, that's right, that's right. But still, how could he... I remember... Zeus would put that those entrails far away from any fire that would ever even be able to burn anything. He made it so difficult to light on fire there that it's you would need Hephaestus. Hmm? What is it? Did you teach Izuku fire breathing? Uh, <laughs> it being on my line of work, him learning from me, it would make sense that he learned how to breathe fire too. <laughs> but then again, he, how did he even get there? I mean, he can't fly. Huh. Now let's see. Wait. The Griffin. Hera! Hmm? The Griffin. That's how? That's how he's getting. <laughs> yes. Wait, how would, he, how would he even find it? I mean, not only we have to know exactly what he was looking for, but we have to at least have, you know, a way of locating it, knowing his exact coordinates. Hey, he's his head, seeing the uh, Hephaestus and swaying bullets. Hephaestus, what did you do? Hmm. Hmm. Do you really want to know? By this point, yes. Let, let's hear. What did you do? Well, he told me he wanted a device that could locate certain object. If he had, knew what he was looking for, and you know, just... good lord, you pretty much set him up to the point where he he could he could probably actually do it. I I am at a loss. Hera, you're scheming. It may actually work this time. I mean by might. Seriously, there, there, there's no way. <laughs> there's no way in the hell he's going to be able to beat Izuku. First of all, he can't kill him. Thanks to the River Sticks. Thank you, Hades. Yeah. It worked. Plus, with him being able to look at the exact location of the remains of the Orpheo Taurus, mixed in with the fact that he can breathe fire now. Thank you, Hephaestus. Uh huh. Now he just needs to acquire Griffin to help him navigate the winds safely. I can't believe how how far did this go? You have no idea how long I've been waiting for my revenge on Zeus. We know. So yes, I, as well as all the others, are grateful for him for freeing us from our father's stomach. He just could not take no for an answer. We know. When the first attempt worked. If only I had 
seriously, if I knew that that no good for nothing, you know. No, no, you don't. Even though I have technically remained a virgin goddess, I still feel so bad. I don't no matter how many times I bathe myself in the waters of we know. Seriously, we know. But for now, we have to worry about Isuku being able to get his new abilities. We don't know how strong he's going to be, but... Wait. Hmm. Hmm. He's going to need some... He's going to need some seclusion. What? He's going to need to be alone for uh, whenever he... You know... Gets these abilities. I mean, you don't just... End up with... God-like power. And instantly know how to use it. Especially as a mortal. Huh. Versus the skill of your forge. We are going to have to build him a safe room. As soon as they get there, it's like, okay, open it. Versus reaching around for his keys. And, oh, that's weird. They're, my keys are gone. What? Yeah. Are you sure you shouldn't drop them or anything? Or uh, it's possible, but frankly, I'm pretty sure I can find them sooner or later. I mean, I do have a key to pretty much every room. What? I have a key to every room. Including Yuzuku's. Well, why did you pause like that? Oh, no. You need to find my keys before Zeus does. As they're running around trying to find these keys, this is when he bumped into Dionysus. And so, hey guys, are we, are we having a party again or something? No, why? Because Zeus just asked me for some of my best wine. I think I gave him a few choices and everything, but uh, if anything, uh, more power to him, but still, I think it's kind of late for another party, don't you? I mean, Zeus is probably long since went to sleep. Uh, yeah. Oh, wait! Them looking, realizing what could happen. Wait, where's Aphrodite? Dionysus. Uh, I see her, but she she went to drinking with Zeus. So I I'm my loss. Is yeah, this is when things go to shit. <laughs>